The third presidential debate was last night, and I could not say anything less than it was a shit show. Um, obviously, the way Donald conducted himself was pretty ridiculous, but that's nothing to expect, because he has done nothing but that throughout this entire campaign process. And there were a few points where I would think Hillary would have hit him harder, but she kind of came in with some softballs. But, you know, she at least did her job. She did what she needed, she needed to. And the polls indicate that she won in the eyes of the public. So there was one, I guess you could say, exchange where Hillary was answering a question and Donald just said something totally, totally outrageous. And let's go right to the clip. Because at this point, Social Security and Medicare are going to run out. The trust funds are going to run out of money. Will you, as president, entertain, will you consider a, a grand bargain, a deal that includes both tax increases and benefit cuts to try to save both programs? Well, Chris, I am on record as saying that we need to put more money into the Social Security trust fund. That's part of uh, my commitment to raise taxes on the wealthy. My... Social Security payroll contribution will go up, as will Donald's, assuming he can't figure out how to get out of it. Uh, but what we want to do is to replenish the Social Such Security Trust woman. Fund by making sure that we have sufficient resources. Wow. He literally said that on national TV during the debate. I mean, don't get me wrong, Donald, there are ways to criticize Hillary, and surprisingly, you've done them in good ways before. You know, slamming her on TPP, slamming her on her foreign policy, all that good stuff. But you're just not intelligent enough to craft anything further. You're just reverting back to slamming her on these ridiculous ad hominems that are getting you nowhere. And that's why he's probably going to lose this election. Obviously, it's not a guarantee for Hillary, but there's, you know, he's he's not going to be in the position he needs to be. But in my opinion, that was a pretty atrocious moment. And honestly, there were sizable portions of that debate that were pretty cringeworthy. But, you know, that's American politics. It's all cringeworthy. We have the lesser of two evils going on. And... Regardless of which side you fall on, I could only expect that you would come to the same conclusion that the entire debate was a shit show.